The fact is the one we need to convince are not in this room. We need to speak to them. We need to convince them. Uh, the fact is uh, we, we, we need to be efficient. We need to, to, to bring people to Palestine. If you see what the UNRWA is doing on the ground, you will understand how this country, this country and the population would be without the UNRWA, without education, without health, without anything. So it is important to convince the other persons. What is terrible, and we have to speak about it, and Philip said it, Israel is going and want to put UNRWA on a terrorist list. They want to, to f he, he's already not able to go in his office. So what can we do now to put pressure on Israel that the one who are convinced here in this UNGA are able to leave UNRWA working, doing their work, and not to, 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 to block them and in fact to, 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 to kill the Palestinian people without the support of the UNRWA. This is the work we have to do today. We should not do it in six months. Afterwards, it will be too late. So please, hurry up, have some ideas, be creative. But how can we put pressure on Israel to make them understanding that there is a rule of law, there is a right of self-defense, but there are limits. And to consider here in this house, in this house, that the agency of the UN is a terrorist organization and we shut up, we are all blind and uh, supporting uh, this behavior. So we have to react.